backstage or off camera, and it just makes me laugh all the time. I am uh, Issa Badiola. What's up? This is the live show for I Have Notes. Uh, before we get started on everything, I just want to do a really quick shout out to our sponsor, ExpressVPN. It's it's 2020. We're in a middle pandemic. What are you doing? Have you not heard of ExpressVPN yet? But if, I mean, we'll talk about that later. But thank you, ExpressVPN, for sponsoring our show. Um, you guys can join us in chat right now. You just have to sign up for a Rooster Teeth account, uh, and there's a free trial. Uh, so first members can join us in chat. Um, and uh, accounts are free us. otherwise, so you can uh, watch all your favorite content while being part of a really awesome community. So thank you guys for uh, uh, listening to me for the first how many seconds of this has been. I am Issa Bediola. Welcome to I Have Notes, uh, the show where us neat people from Ouch. animation or otherwise come together and talk all things animation being creative, and making accounts on other websites so no one can steal our identities. <laughs> uh, I am joined by our lovely, my, our lovely co-host, Carrie Shawcross. Uh, hello, my name is Carrie Shawcross. This is uh, Mike Michael Mikington, the Mike. Um, you're all very familiar with uh, his works. Um, uh, and besides this, this lovely guest, um, we have two very, very lovely guests, always lovely guests. Uh, first off, we have Aaron Wynn. Hello. Hey, hello. I got my froggy hey. cup. Oh, froggy cup! Stay hydrated. Stay hydrated. And of course, and of course, the the lovely, the beautiful Eddie <gasps> Rivas. Hello. Hello, oh, Eddie. I thought I thought there was another guest, and then I was going to be the one after no, the lovely guest. No, it's, it's you, buddy. It's, <laughs> it's you, buddy. Think, it's all I you. I think you're lovely. I think you're beautiful. I'm very um, excited about this. I think you're Superman, <laughs> which is Whoa. the lunchbox in the background. Mm-hmm. Yes. Whoa, my, good my, here's the thing. My daughter won it in the Halloween costume contest, or she mm-hmm. won a choice for a prize, and she was like, I want extra candy. And I was like, no, you don't. You want that Superman lunchbox. <laughs> and then I, nice. and then wow. I took it from her. Good parenting. <laughs> yeah, and then I was in your office. Oh, well, who, Interesting. Who paid for the costume? <laughs> I mean, come on. I won. I won the contest. Uh, now, I do – I want to uh, – Isa, I want to, you know, obviously I'm not, uh, you are better at the interest than I am. So I'm not even, a, even, even joke about that. It did sound like you said meet people and not meet oh, people. And meet I just wanted people. to clarify that okay. you did, you do consider us neat people and not, and yes. not meet, meet people. Persons. I mean, both are true. We are, uh, we are meat absolutely. and fluids. We are meat people. And I, I just checked. I just yeah. kind of want to know what you wanted to uh, uh, highlight, which one you were looking to highlight. Well, it was definitely neat people. Funny enough, V2 Blast in chat, uh, and we're yeah. paying attention, uh, <laughs> also said neat people as in N-E-E-T, which yeah. is the acronym for oh. not experienced, not employed, not trained. <laughs> so oh. <laughs> basically, that was me. the exact opposite of all of us because we're all currently employed. <laughs> oh, yeah, if you valid. aspire to be a neat, does, is that cancel it out? I don't, I don't know. think I knew so, a guy right? named Neat. I, I, I learned that entire term from, uh, like, N-E-E-T. Like, N-E-A-T, like, Neat. Like, his name was Neat. Yeah, then, I mean, uh, I meant I meant by N-E-A-T. Yeah. He he had a brother named Lion. There was Neat, and there was Lion. And then they had a third brother who I felt really bad for because his name was, like, Carl. <laughs> like, the, <or> whatever. <laughs> like, it was the most normal name. <laughs> The, was it the, were they the was Carl the youngest or the oldest? He was the youngest. Like okay. his parents yeah. just got tired of it. They were like, "This was kind of dumb. <laughs> Why did yeah. we do this?" I thought you they were gonna have, say like the wardrobe left. or something, <laughs> some like Narnia shit. That Mr. Toughness. I I like I don't know if I'm ever gonna have kids, but like if I I I always think about like, do I want to do the like name them like Han or like do I just want to name them like Philip and just be like. This is a name. This is a name everybody Normal knows. Normal name. I yeah. knew I, a girl in high school whose first name was Miss Katie. Like, M-I-S-S space Katie. What? <laughs> that was her first name. Yeah. It was It was. I, okay. <laughs> okay. I'm going to say two conflicting things. Mm-hmm. Um, I think anybody should be able to express themselves how they want to. I think their parents should go to jail. <laughs> <laughs> now, I know... It seems a little left and right of the scales there. 
Um, but how did that go for them? I mean, they still go by Miss Katie to this day, I believe. It's still on their Facebook. If they get married, would yeah, they be Mrs. Mrs. Miss Katie? Mrs. That's Ms. what Katie. we asked her all the time. And she's like, basically. Yep. Yeah. She, she oh. was fine with it. Does so. anyone... Does anyone ever think about how you might get, you might come across more whack names the more, like, south you go? Oh, yeah, definitely. Mm-hmm. Okay. My mom's a uh, nurse practitioner, so she, like, deals with, like, newborns and all that. Oh, and no. she gets the wackiest baby names. Holy shit. I feel like, yeah, some of these parents should definitely be arrested. And, like, when you go, I... like, really south, like, in Antarctica, they're, like, the penguins are named... Like, yeah <laughs> and like olaf um elsa really hey eddie really happy to have you on really yeah, happy to that was a good joke <laughs> i told y'all that i was a little lightheaded and uh <laughs> my... yeah i don't like that part i mean goofy's good though i I'm... at least you're sitting down so I mean, it's, it's not as high of a fall yeah. if you like fall over i mostly just try to get is... reactions from isa when i say things <laughs> I, it's the best <laughs> it's my favorite part of the show is like when it's like all right cool I just like I said something and now there's like a timer and Issa's like done for ten seconds. It's very good. It's like it's what I strive for. I try um, to do that in meetings. Me, any meeting I'm in with Issa and I can see her on camera. I just try to yeah, shut her try, down. Yeah, he tries to make me laugh. And yeah. I fucking get or just bring up your wholesome. opinions on on uh, the Last Jedi, um, <laughs> and get into it. Um, which I, we don't need to do here. I was in a meeting with Joe Clary. Uh, I've been in a lot of meetings with Joe Clary recently. Um, our like, about it. studio head, uh, Joe Clary. <laughs> and uh, I don't know his official title, but he's one of our studio heads. The and, uh, Joe I believe he is the co head of co-head. studio. Yeah. Yes. So uh, he. Maybe. <laughs> we were he was like leading this meeting and it was a very important meeting with uh mm-hmm. just it was an important meeting uh with yeah with some people we don't Everybody's normally meet business, with business business yes, mm-hmm, very, business very very business and i sent him something in the middle of it and i saw oh, no. i was watching his screen and he was like like oh. started hiding his mouth <laughs> like in the middle of it he's like you cannot do that to me <laughs> laura did that to me yesterday <laughs> we were in a meeting and she just slacked me and she said happy 420 <laughs> and it was it was 420 and i was just i was mid talking looked down went <laughs> anyways blah, blah, blah. and like so nobody knew what happened but i slacked her after her. i was like god damn it <laughs> it's so funny i love doing it it's the best when you could like get somebody it really is yeah I would, Something we uh, needed. Yeah, when uh, whenever we were, you know, back in the the yesteryear when uh, we were in office, the uh, my my roommate Alex and I, like, we would do stuff like that where like I would just like text him like, look at me, and he would look over, and I would just be like, like looking at him, just like <laughs> not just making eye contact and like just being weird, and like I I just love doing stuff like that, like inside jokes and like I don't know, I'm I've always been I've gotten in trouble for being class clown before, so. It's class like, clown oh. yeah, my favorite kind of person honestly yeah. it's true yes yeah it's, you should do that you know. to joe clary and it's like look at me and then you're like i'm the co-head of the studio now yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah well, we have to average it out based on heights um, yeah. <laughs> see Carrie, so. what you do is you get another hat that says co-head and put it oh, on top of your, your stack of hats that's true. Then you're yeah. Taller. yeah yeah i'll have I, like i'll just have a hat for everything yeah, exactly. and then I'll have oh, here's my co-head hat. Here's my Joe Clary hat, and now you have to pretend that I'm Joe Clary. Carrie's got a director Joe hat. Joe Clary has like a giant top hat. To yeah. make yourself taller. <laughs> Joe Clary's very tall. It's like a ten yeah. gallon hat. Yeah. It's yeah. like Joe Clary's very tall, and I'm, and I'm uh, you know, I'm I'm slightly above average. Um, you know, somewhere in there. No, nobody knows I'm sitting. Mm-hmm. That's true. You, know? you can't tell our our heights from this yeah. arrangement either. We're all the you same can only right guess via our head size. I mean, really, I I there's there's more at the top of frame of Eddie's camera than mine, so yeah, maybe I'm taller than Eddie. I don't know. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. Uh oh, God, we pasted. St- now I don't know where the actual our notes are anymore. There they are. Um, there they so are. Congrats. Oh hey, can we can we celebrate a really cool thing? Yes. Um, let's would... make Aaron talk about it because it'll make oh, her uncomfortable. No. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, 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 go. go. Praise I mean, Aaron. Praise Aaron. Oh, no, no. Uh, don't look at me. Um, I mean, we kind of talked about it last week. Um, the Extra Life uh, Ruby original sketches that were up for auction have sold. And do we do we want to make it a game? Do we? Oh, well, y'all already, already looked. I'm staring you know, at it right so. now. Yeah, okay, never mind. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, yeah, it sold for almost 2K. 
So Woo! Yay! almost two thousand dollars for so, the yeah. kids. For, for the, the kids. kids. Thank you so much. Like it's awesome, and I I hope it helps a lot of kids out there. Yay! What are you, what are you gonna do with the actual money? Uh, well, uh, we know we know how this. I'm just kidding. It's gonna go to the kids. It's gonna go <laughs> straight, <laughs> straight to the kids. Straight, straight to the kids. S two K. I don't see a penny of it. Yeah. So. Yeah. But that's awesome. I'm super. I'm. I'm very proud of you. It's. Oh, they look nice. really cool. Even uh-huh. though you said you don't like them. Yeah. Uh, and clearly, clearly they're worth a lot. So, uh, I think it's worth it. Yeah. Thank you. And there's hope, a, there's a hundred. Whoever gets them enjoys them. I don't think they're worth that must, much. But. <laughs> there's 104 bids on it. I'm gonna assume that that's either 104 people or two people bidding 52 times each. Um, either way, <laughs> thank you. Yes, there's no yes. in between. Um, thank you for for donating to the kids, and I hope you enjoy your Delorous your sketchies. Yes, um, he's beautiful sketchies. What's uh, you know, Eddie? It's been it's been a minute since you've been on. I mean, mm-hmm. this is our, our classic recurring segment. What's how's everybody's week been? Turkey day's oh, coming up. Short week. Short, short week. 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 That's short which means thing. it's short long. Week. Yeah, which yeah. actually yeah means it's long. <laughs> five days worth of work in three that's five true. days of work in three <laughs> nah, that's fine to be I'm fair sure. i've gotten i've been able to be like hey matt can i like not have 10 meetings on this day and have more like nine yeah. <laughs> and i've been able to like eliminate I, some of my meetings. i think everybody's oh, been in the nice. holiday mood because there's been yes. a lot of like do we really need to do that meeting this week? Yeah. I had two of those week, today. Right? It was it was great. Yeah. It like cleared up my whole afternoon. It was like, oh, yeah. do we need to? I was like, no, we don't. Yeah. Oh. I actually so got I, something so. done. Yeah. yeah. I clear I clear my day and then I almost had plumbing issues, so that was fun. Yeah. Oh no. My, my toilet decided it wanted to start overflowing. Oh and, no. Yeah. I was like, oh God. So I'll just scoop out this water and Ooh. plunge it a bit. And oh, no. I think I fixed it. Did, did okay, your cats get in there? Do they know how to use it? <laughs> they did not. Happened? I don't know why okay. I clogged. Okay. We don't, we don't I haven't been taking it. any... Uh, my my, my poo-poos have been fine lately, <laughs> so I don't know what happened. I, I was, you were like, I don't know why I clogged. I was going to be like, sure you don't. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. I don't know why it happened, though. Yeah. I don't, I don't right, get it, for but the whatever. Jar. Yeah. There you go. Does anybody... Uh, or Aaron, you, Aaron, are you the only one here that has cats? I think so, right? Yes, just you and me. Yeah. Do you do you ever when your cat goes to the restroom? Do you ever like walk in the room afterward and go like, "Ooh, big stinky"? Oh yeah. I mean, I have okay. you can't see me because I'm blocking it, but there's a litter box right behind me. Oh, okay. And I have another one in the, my bathroom, but yeah, uh, it's it's it kind of sucks, but yeah. it motivates me to scoop scoop the poop. <laughs> yeah, you gotta do it. I don't know. I just like rewarding him for uh, <laughs> you did a good job. A good job. <laughs> Yeah. so proud of you i mean yeah. what, what my cat's uh pooper um she is definitely getting older so she does miss the litter box sometimes so i do i do feel like i have to reward her but she does good wow so, mm. yeah do, do you i mean she is a cat she yes she, she's she. a cat so therefore is also an asshole by default oh yeah do you definitely. do you think she's missing the the toy the the litter box or trying to send a message I think she's just missing the litter box. Okay, it happens. She's not us. that much of an asshole. Okay, okay. Uh, she's just a little shit sometimes. Yeah. Quite she's literally. Yeah, mm-hmm. she's a sweetie. Uh, Eddie, Eddie, how, how have you been since you since you you last been on? How, how have you been doing? I've been busy. Um, work's mm. been work's been busy. It's actually a little bit lighter right now than it normally is since kind of uh, you know wrapped Ruby Volume Nine. So we've got a little bit of a of a pause in writing, writing stuff. Not, yeah. Yeah. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Writing, writing, God, really, writing, 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 not everything else. Um, but yeah, like done. Take, take writing, a so. Yeah. So we're kind of in the, there's always like a little bit of a lull before the next uh, thing starts writing again. Um, mm. So in that regard, it's a little bit lighter. There's a bunch of other projects and stuff I'm working on, but I've also been like doing like virtual school for my kids at the same uh-huh. time, like a hundred percent of the time, which has been insane. And this week, do you, do you th- yeah, what's that? No, I was I, I was I was gonna say, do you feel like you you deserve like a honorary degree? No. After oh no, after I've this? been no. That's the thing. It's like I'm I've been like a terrible teacher <laughs> because of like it's just it's insanity between the two of them. But uh, uh. this week they're not in school and uh, they're with their mom this week. So I actually like 
all I'm doing is working and it feels like a vacation <laughs> in comparison. <laughs> wow. I was like, this week's awesome. <laughs> I was like, I could like focus and do like what I need to do at like my own time and I don't feel like I'm letting people down all the time. It's great. Oh no. <laughs> wow. I mean, look, if it if it works, it works. And yeah. you've been doing yeah. great. Don't worry. Yes. Yeah. Thank you. I'm you, trying. you should get dad of the year. Yeah. Didn't, didn't you just you just showed your kids uh, uh, Into the Spider-Verse, right? Oh, God. They were so, like, delighted by that movie. I don't know if I've ever seen them, like, so overjoyed as as they were during that movie. Um, oh, even during before. Frozen? Like, they liked they liked things like Frozen and stuff, but Into the Spider-Verse, mm-hmm. they were, like, cracking up at the jokes. And, mm-hmm. like, any time he was, like, doing more Spider-Man-y things, they're just like, <gasps> and they were, like, they were super into it. I don't, I don't think I've ever seen them that into a movie before. They were, they yeah, loved it. And I woke yeah. up the next morning and they were watching it again. <laughs> so. Oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> yeah, they loved it. They, so they, they, they know, uh, they know the difference between a movie and a, a film. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, they, I mean it, just, it makes a lot of sense, right? Most kids' movies are just garbage, <laughs> right? So, like, yeah. yeah. You know, uh, comparatively speaking, you know, it's uh, it's definitely like the raised bar. <laughs> yeah, at, well, at, like I feel like Avatar: The Last Airbender and like Into the Spider Verse are like those are examples of like just talk to your kid like an, they're an adult and they'll yeah. they'll uh, appreciate that and like they'll respond to it better. It's like you know, it's not Teletubbies. No, no knock on Teletubbies, but <laughs> whoa, get right uh, Teletubbies, I guess. Yeah, <laughs> hey, you know what? Yeah, yeah. I, I mean, that's our new thumbnail now. I'm sure. Carrie finding the Teletubbies. Yeah, uh, that would be fun. <laughs> Do you think they're squishy or firm? I think they. I think it would bounce off of them like a giant, right? um, oh. one of those yoga balls or whatever. How many Teletubbies Ooh, do you think you could so fight at firm. once? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Am- I could take. <laughs> I feel Are we like armed? We could... Oh, mm. well, unarmed. I feel like maybe we could just take Poe on because that's the smallest one. Oh, you know their names, huh? You do you not? I don't. I don't know any of their names. Oh my god! <laughs> I just know Poe. They're just punching bags to me. Well, yeah. <laughs> all all I see are oh, tinky targets. Winky. <laughs> yeah, it's Tinky Winky. All I see are victims. It's Tinky Winky, Dipsy. I forget the la- the third one. Lala. It's Lala, Lala and Poe. I would. I would. I would punch the fucking sun baby. That's what I would do. <laughs> I'm just about to say. I love the sun baby. I hate it. It's just the annoying orange. <laughs> like no i could oh probably take I'm on all of them at the same time probably i think you could <laughs> well i think you could <laughs> like a you train like, that, that's a, a common knowledge yeah. yeah okay well eddie let's let's ratchet up the stakes so two of them have horns let's say those are sharp now okay um and let's say they're all seven feet tall uh oh that's God. that's a little bit more difficult um <laughs> okay okay this is a weird episode of Death Battle. <laughs> <laughs> Get them on the Zelda. phone right now. <laughs> Ever, nobody. Okay, we gotta stop talking about this. They're gonna. No, 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 okay. okay. No, I, wait, wait, I no, have, we'll script it. Never mind. Um, I, I have a random do, bit of oh info. God, I'm looking at their faces and I'm upset. Wait, what do you say? I have a random. I have a random bit of info that I feel like Aaron would like this. So is this more Teletubby lore. No, it, it, oh. but it is something like children related. Oh, like I thought it was like, you, you got their stats? What's their reach? How much do they weigh? <laughs> <laughs> Poe's what red, so animals? he's weak to water, clearly. <laughs> um, so uh, that little girl, have you, so you guys know about um, oh, the, uh, the haunting of Bly Manor, right? Yeah. I've, I've seen like a couple episodes of it. So there's a little girl in it. It's that little blonde oh, yeah. girl. And she's British and she's always like, Per- this is perfect, perfectly splendid. Like, she'll say that kind of thing. And for the longest time, I kept thinking, why does she sound so familiar and so annoying? <gasps> and it Wait, turns out, gonna... it turns is out it she's Pig? the voice of Peppa Pig. Oh my God! <laughs> Whoa. I was like, wait, you said through the voice right now. That's not yes. very familiar. It's a fe- I can't believe you got it. <laughs> Peppa Pig cracks Pe- me the fuck up. I don't know Peppa what about Pig. it. I love, Pig. I love Pig. I love the memes. So the, the the TikTok meme from like a year ago of Peppa Pig was the best. It was basically people would like hide Peppa Pig like like a, like a little figure in like or like a cutout in like oh, their fridge this. or something, and they would open it up and they go, Peppa, <laughs> what are you doing here? And it was just like what? The? And, and of course it's a meme. Uh, it doesn't make any sense. You're all gonna think this is terrible. 
hey, if you were on early TikTok, you'll get it, okay? I, miss, I somehow missed this, <laughs> get it. which is kind of early surprising. Because anybody who knows my obsession with Peppa Pig always links me. I did not know. But now you do. Yeah, now, now I, I want to pitch a. I think uh, one year an anime for Peppa Christmas... Pig. Uh, Jordan Sweers got me like a Peppa Pig coloring book. Yes, oh yes. <laughs> I think it was his souvenir when when he went to um, London. That's, that's what it was. Yeah, yeah. Mm. The capital of of Peppa of Peppa Pig. <laughs> <laughs> I, I had a dumb joke, but I missed it. Uh, Aaron, how's your week been? Um, oh man, I, that was I, mean, I know. I told you, I, told you I, I nearly flooded my apartment. Oh, that's right. Um, yeah, <laughs> that was probably your main focus, huh? Deep, yeah, yeah <laughs> yep. Uh, deep in Ruby Lands, still chugging along. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. I mean, I don't know. It's only Tuesday. I don't know what else to tell you. Man. I know. It, it, man, it feels like it's Monday Thursday. was a week, guys. <laughs> yeah. Really, I mean, in excuse me, in some respects, it is. Yeah. You know, if, if you stretch out time. Uh, subjectively and contort it um you know yeah it's, it's going Jeremy. okay you know yeah Issa i've been Perry. playing video How games about, how's y'all's week yeah oh yeah video games what mm. video games are you playing uh i beat bug snacks <gasps> which is like almost a horror game and i would have been interested <laughs> to see it go that way but it did turn out very it's still very good um you told me you were gonna playing... you were gonna platinum that Oh, I did. Oh, you did? <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah, that's I right. did. I did. MLG There's a re- gamer. Are y'all are y'all okay with like a slight bug snack spoiler? No. It's not like it's not like okay, that's fine. Actually, <laughs> no, that's fine. I, I, I mean no, uh, so so the whole thing in the game is that this is just fucked up, okay? So the okay. whole thing in the game is that you you know, you feed these bug snacks to the other characters in the game. Like so you feed this like strawberry bug snack to a character. And then, like, there are, you can make their arm turn into, like, a strawberry or their leg or whatever. There's this one character that refuses to eat bug snacks. Like, the whole, their whole thing is, like, they want to protect them and they have, like, a little farm and you, like, donate instead of feeding and that kind of stuff. And then I was looking at the trophies. And one of the trophies is to completely transform, basically feed, like, ten bug snacks to every villager. Oh, no. And I was like, oh. how do you do that? And then I noticed that at midnight every night, <gasps> this villager sleepwalks. Uh. And you can feed them against their will. Oh, my God. That's that's horrifying, actually. It's, <laughs> it's actually kind of unsettling because the whole thing looks like Teletubbies. So They're all like these the like thing is, bears called grumpuses. So you platinumed it. So you did it? I did. <laughs> you monster. I did. Uh, I felt terrible because I did it. And then the next day I went back to him. He's like, I don't know what's happening. I don't like this. And then like I waited until midnight the next night. And I was like, too bad. And I sh- shoved a whole bunch more down his fucking mouth. Um, you know, you got to do what you got to do. Man, this game is whack. It's it's really interesting. It's got some good men- uh, messages in it. Not that one. Not, Not that, that one. one. <laughs> um, but, Not that one. Uh, it's fun. It's fun. Aww. You know, that's not uh, frightening. I'm just watching the chat right now. That's like, that got dark. <laughs> it's like, yeah, <laughs> yeah. E for everyone. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> the, like, that whole game, I was just waiting for the, if you're familiar, like, the, the Doki Doki Literature Club turn. Oh, like, yeah. it felt like it was, like, always, like, right there. And, like, any moment, they were going to, like, turn to me and be like, but you can be a Bug Snacks, too. <laughs> like, I was just waiting for that. Um, but, uh, they didn't, you do try and eat one at one point, but you have, a. Uh, um, they imply that you, uh, void somehow. I don't, I don't know which end. Wow. They, and they just say you're allergic to bug snacks, so you can't oh. eat them. Um, so you die. They explain it. Mm-hmm. You know? Sure. Yeah, they clog, they clog the toilet. There is a toilet. <laughs> <laughs> Can you shove <laughs> bug snacks down the toilet? No, just randomly throughout the day, like one of the characters will be like, oh, 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 and they'll just like run over to the toilet, and you can't talk to them until they're done. It's so weird. It's really good. It's really good. Oh, oh no, the chat just caught up to me saying I did it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, chat. I'm sorry. I felt terrible until I got the trophy, and then I felt accomplished. <laughs> well, that's how that's how they want you to feel. Yeah, oh, I've been doing that. I've been playing some retro games. I. uh 
been replaying through Metroid Fusion, one of my oh, yeah. favorite Metroids, mm. which oh, is yeah. my favorite genre, Metroidvania, and Metroid? that's that's what I've been doing. Nice. Kind of crazy that there's a whole genre named after that, huh? Yeah, it's. I mean, I, I, it's it, it, the weird thing. Yeah. yeah. And the Thank weird thing, too, I've never, like, Metroidvania games are, like, my favorite genre of games. Like, Hollow Knight is, like, top three favorite games of all time. Um, yeah. I've, I love, like, a lot of those, like, the 2D Metroid games. Um, never played a Castlevania game ever. Oh, should. Oh, wow. Um, so I need to. It's kind of, like, I have these list of games that, like, if, like, the, like, it basically, like, call it, like, rainy day. Call it, like, I get super fired or something. I don't know. <laughs> um, where I'm just, like, oh, I'm just sitting around now um i've there like that's on my list of uh of games i, mean, I love that i love that there's in your mind there's there's different tiers of being fired there's fired. like regular fired and then there's like super fired <laughs> hey <laughs> hey think about it there are there there's the difference <laughs> there's a difference and, and I mean, one of those maybe oh i God. need to just play some video games for a couple weeks you know you know and uh one of them will be that I was, I, I was legitimately wondering. I was like, what would, you, what would I do if I was super fired? Mm-hmm. And then I was like, I don't know if I want to think about that or talk about yeah. it. <laughs> <laughs> for, me, any, it, for me, it's uh, it's play like a buttload of games I've been meaning to play and eat an entire pack of Oreos in one day. Mm. That's what I would do. The, the, okay, yeah. <laughs> one day. One day. One day. Yeah. Well, hopefully not, but... I hope if one I need day to. I get super fired. Yeah, I will do it in one day. <laughs> I was like, super fired sounds cool. Uh, Issa, what are you doing? You've been doing uh, some good stuff. Oh, yeah. I Guys, I have hobbies. <laughs> hobbies. Oh, hobbies. But, and that, I feel like that's like actually a big achievement. And part of it is because um, I think if you've been creative, I, we talk about this kind of the idea of like being creative as a main job. What do you do as yeah. uh, mm-hmm. after hours, right? Um, what how how do you feel fulfilled in this scenario if you feel like uh, like you know all your creative juices mm-hmm. end up being used during the day? Um, yeah, six uh, o'clock comes around, I'm dry. Yeah. Yes. It's, <laughs> Yeah. You have two like, minutes left. Not a, not a whop anymore. If you know what no, I mean. No, 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 <laughs> no. I'm, I'm, I'm SpongeBob and Sandy's dome. Exactly. What are Sandy? And... Yeah. What's that? <laughs> Aaron, you are Sandy. I am. Um, there's, uh, so I think, um, what is it? Recently, I've had a lot of like interesting conversations and i've finally came across like this happy medium not necessarily a happy medium but you know it's at that point of the year where i finally get my bearings on what i want to do after work um mm. it's november it's november <laughs> <laughs> hey better and, late than ever yeah <laughs> and it is also like you know how long have i been working for rooster teeth like Five years five plus. Years. Yeah. So uh, coming up on six in April. So it's like one of those things just like, oh, wow. Like I finally kind of understood the thing that I want to do after work. And that was I got in. I'm going back actually into embroidery. Um, so that has been my hobby. That has been kind of like, oh, I finally found something that I kind of want to do. Um, which is not animation, which is not like trying to input large meaning into artistic mm-hmm. pieces it was just me going i just need to do a small thing and then not think consequently for like mm-hmm. three days mm-hmm. and um mm-hmm. it took a long time and that has been my journey <laughs> hey the stuff you've been making is great and yeah. your uh, latest piece I holy know. shit it is popping off on twitter i wanted to it's buy also, that like so literally bad. yeah i was so i was so mad that it's already yeah, yeah. like that that like, having the like 3d is. braid thing like, yeah. That's so cool. oh yeah the, it's it's Aerith. really interesting. Yeah, Aerith. Um, uh, Aerith. Uh, it's really interesting because when you start looking up like what other embroidery things there are, um, there are artists that do that, but you kind of just think like, how do I do that? So that it was, it took me like a couple of days of research to be like, oh, there are tutorials out there. <laughs> you just kind of have to like YouTube it or like figure it out. And then um, after that, it's just like doing... Uh, incorporating that into your own stuff but that's the neat part i'm like oh i can just make something that looks pretty yeah 
it's you basically you just do it like the the play-doh thing where it's like you like squished it down and like made the hair like that's <laughs> that's, how, that's how it works right i really it's want pretty... to take a tiny barbie brush and comb out her hair yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah i think it's also i mean yeah we talked about it before but it's like it's nice to have it, it it really does seem like a, a, a like a happy medium like middle ground of like it it is still creative and like execution and like how you want to do things and you obviously are like you know applying art skills that you know to it but it's also not the thing anywhere, you do all day yeah yeah mm-hmm. anywhere near anything you, that you normally do you know yeah. like um and it, and it doesn't have the like longer consequences now you could start making like a comic <laughs> series all done in embroidery. See, y'all say that, but I actually follow an artist on Instagram that does embroidery animation. Like, she'll embroider yes. frames and Whoa. make, like, get an animation. Yeah, I'll have to Like, look stop her motion up. kind of stuff? Yeah, I yeah, think so. Yeah, kind of. I'll, I'll find her. Yeah, Issa, let's take the on. thing that's, let's take the thing that's, like, allowing you to relax. <laughs> yeah. And turn and, it back and, into how work. How can we commodify this? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what if you completed one and then the video paused? And then it started rotating because you actually 3D modeled it and realistically rendered it <laughs> and applied a hair simulation. You're like and, breaking uh, Issa's brain. <laughs> yeah. Like you turn around to the other side and now Aerith's on the other side and starts talking and we go into music <laughs> with, with yarn. Oh, I basically could just make like the Yoshi yarn game, but with it. <laughs> yes. Ooh. I love it. Just just make all the, all the games, but Yoshi yarnify it. It is. I I never really played that game, but I do own all of the amiibos because it's a very good art style. It's it very is. cute. Yeah. Um, but thanks, guys. I yeah. appreciate. It's very cool. The support. I'm not gonna find it right now. If I find it, I'll put it on Twitter or something. But that's where all things cool go. Stuff. You can yeah. fleet it. I can. Oh no. <laughs> I'm all about the fleets. <laughs> well, <laughs> let's let's talk about that after. I don't even know how to look at them. Oh, you don't have them yet. Eddie, oh, oh no! Oh, it's an exclusive Eddie. club. We're yeah. going to talk about that right after Issa talks about how you can keep your fleets protected. Yes, it's true. Um, oh, no, guys. I, <laughs> I'm wholly unprepared for but this. But first, we're going to talk about fleets more. And then uh, when Issa's ready, we can talk about... Uh... Wait, I'm ready now. Okay, and now, right, back to before it. we talk about fleets, we're going to talk about this. Back right, to you, Lisa. Hi guys. How's the weather? Hi, guys. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> that was a wonderful segue for me to talk about our sponsor for today. <laughs> um, ExpressVPN. Have you guys heard of them yet? <laughs> now that you're spending more of your life online, you're giving advertisers and your ISP more opportunities to gather information about you. You're working from home and think about all the confidential information that you have and that you handle. ExpressVPN keeps your private information private. It provides a layer of protection to prevent others from being able to see what you're researching or researching, what you're searching for or researching for and what sites you visit. Your data will also be safe when you use ExpressVPN because ExpressVPN ensures that 100% of your data is trans- being transferred between all of your uh, devices and stuff um, is encrypted. It's easy to use and it's user friendly. So if you visit our special link down below at expressvpn, VPN, VPN, expressvpn.com slash RTTV, you can get an extra three months for ExpressVPN free. Uh, support the show, watch what you want, and protect yourself with ExpressVPN at expressvpn.com slash RTTV. Thank you for sponsoring the show. Thank you. Thank you. Now, let's talk about fleets. Wait. Wait. I have another one. Let's talk oh. about fleets right after this. <laughs> uh, on top of that, guys, also, if you haven't heard, uh, we have a really awesome store site-wide uh, deal going on for Black Friday. Um, it is the Thanksgiving holidays. We can talk about that soon as well. Uh, but uh, after Thanksgiving is Black Friday, but also you can start Black Friday early <laughs> by having this buy two, get one free site-wide all week at store.com, store.roosterteeth.com happening right now. You can get some really cool stuff. I'm wearing a Cam Cam shirt. Carrie is wearing another shirt. Wink. <laughs> I know Aaron and uh, Eddie. Oh, hey, what a cool hey. shirt. That's a I cool know. shirt. 
Eddie and Aaron are wearing um uh, Oh no, you can't even see mine. Shirts. I have to like stand up wearing the Yeah. I was like, wow. <laughs> Show it off. And we're Show like kind of matching. Yeah, we're we kind are. Kind of matching. Yeah. It's super cute. I love it. So you guys can get that when you go to store.richteeth.com. Buy two, get one free, site wide. Hey. Okay, that's it. We can talk about fleets. Are we sure? Now. I don't want to anymore. I'm done with fleets already. <laughs> Old news. <laughs> Old news. It was a the moment was fleeting. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh. I mean, I, 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 I for that reason we should not go back to it. It is all done now because of that. I'm fine with that. Let's talk about okay. Thanksgiving. Let's talk about Thanksgiving. <laughs> Turkey Day. Gobble gobble gobble. I'm gonna fleet all Thanksgiving Day. I'm gonna I'm gonna fleet. I don't know. I mean, it's gonna be weird this year. Yeah. Uh, mm-hmm. Is anybody? able to do small family things safely i'm seeing my mother nice and maybe my dad we were gonna have a nice. bigger gathering and mm. then my brother and sister-in-law were like nope uh so yeah it's gonna be a quiet uneventful thanksgiving i'm kind of okay with it though personally quiet and chill sounds yeah. very good this year i need that in my life right now yeah yeah because i also i the thing i want in my life is not the virus yeah. so <laughs> that's what i want yeah i've got i i'm i'm very fortunate i've got a, a small family and they're close by so i'll be able to do a little bit but we're still gonna be super safe mm-hmm. and uh not uh not take any chances because uh yeah yeah i'm gonna be oh, doing i'm gonna be doing a thing <laughs> with like just my just like my kids here pretty much so um oh. uh i have them on Thanksgiving. are y'all gonna make hand turkeys no, not hand turkey, but like I, I'm basically like I've, I bought like way too much food because it really is just me and them, and so it's oh, just really? food that I want to oh. eat all day. And my plan is just to make food and eat and day drink, like all day. That sounds amazing. And then that we'll just have amazing. movies wow, on. Yeah, that's and, a vacation. Uh, and then make some hand turkeys and send them to me. Yeah. Oh. Uh, so I mean, like I feel like everyone can expect probably like a drunk AMA on Twitter for me later <laughs> on Thanksgiving evening because I imagine I will just be like going all day long. Um, my mine will be where's my hand turkey? <laughs> <laughs> You're like where's my hand turkey? And I'll be like I'm not gonna give this joke up until I get a until uh, I get a hand turkey. Okay. <laughs> do they ever? Do people make foot turkeys? Is that a finish? No. I don't want to get into it. Issa, what are you doing? Another pitch for OnlyFans. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a faux turkey. But like tofu turkey. Foot. Tofu turkey. I'm staying inside. Uh, <laughs> away from me. Away from, me. <laughs> away from you. Away from um, ham turkeys. I'm staying here. I'm from ham turkeys. Um, uh, we made a decision to stay uh, in Austin for the year, which Smart. has been met yep. by um, uh, puppy dog puppy eye puppy dog eyes uh, yeah. from my mother. I yeah. I know you you were also in this situation, Eddie, as well. Yes. Um, it's been, you know, it's like uh, I think I made this. I thought I made this very adult decision, and I I knew my family would understand, or I thought I th- I thought they would, but then. It was like this kind of knee-jerk reaction where my mom was like, but Kuya came back because he's traveling for business. Uh, Why can't you, you know? Oh, and I'm man. like, mother, you know, I made a I'm very a smart decision. child. <laughs> <laughs> um, and so I'm like, I was so mad because it felt like my mom was like upending this Uh-oh. very yeah. adult decision that Absolutely. I made. And I keep saying adult because I'm 28 years old. Yeah. <laughs> you get it, Eddie. Yeah. And then um, I FaceTimed with her and then she did the whole, but, you know. <laughs> oh, man, okay, come? so. And I'm like, mom, I'm sad. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I like... not to see it. I got, I got like multiple calls from my family last week, all like, they were all nice about it, you know, trying, like basically telling me why they thought it would be safe. Cause like the whole family's getting together. Um, mm-hmm. And, and I was kind of like, no, it's, uh, they were, they were kind about it. They weren't super pressury, um, but it was, you know, like several calls. And then like, I finally like told them yesterday, like, Hey, I'm not coming. Um, mm-hmm. And then my mom didn't respond for like, Two, oh, like, no. like 36 hours which like my mom doesn't do unless That's she's very time. upset um, oh, no. and then she called and left a message today still trying to like convince me to come and i'm like Ugh. like it was it was it last there was a point last week where me and like my like 
my brother and his wife and like one of my cousins we were all texting each other because like every like all the kids were coordinating like wait who is being safe like what's going on is this even possible like like mom is not gonna let this go and i was we were basically at that point we were like let's make a pact to like <laughs> when we get older that we don't make like our kids jump through a bunch of hoops to protect our feelings <laughs> like <laughs> like when we get older like let's just respect our kids decisions and not guilt them into things you know yeah, yeah. and just like thing. and just make sure our kids like it's my lunchbox you know <laughs> <laughs> like it's fair. mine fair Hey, look, she got an extra bag of candy and the lunchbox. And so she was able to have a bag of candy. She got got the gift of winning. Yeah. And you got the gift of a gift. Yeah. 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 Well, now, I mean, and now in like 10 years, you can like give it to her and be like, oh, yeah. Like, okay, this, remember this vintage. Yeah. yeah. Put memories in it. You're and keeping like, it safer. And you open it and it's just like a moldy sandwich. You're like, I'll, oh, yeah, I'll put, the, I'll put the hand turkeys that we make this year in the, in the lunchbox. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's, you know, yeah, I, I just, I want, if people want there to be a Christmas, we need to be safe. Exactly. That's all I'll say. Um, if y'all want to have future Thanksgivings and Christmases, yeah. Yeah. you should stay it's, safe and maybe miss it this once. This once. I'm, I'm just still mad that we as a society had the audacity to have two, two events, um, literally a month apart that, yeah. are, that are turkey based. <laughs> It bothers the fuck out of me. I'm actually not having turkey for Thanksgiving. Listen, tur- turkey Ooh. sucks, we're having, dude. We're just having like. I said it. Turkey it's sucks. Right. It, it's fine. It comes out Ooh. dry almost all the time. It's probably Our... the worst bird to eat. <laughs> <laughs> on, I, on a, on a ranking list. list of birds, turkey's down there. Yeah. I've got I've got no way to defend that. Yeah, I mean, it's because it's yeah. the truth. But here's my thing: once a year, oh, it's like a fun spectacle. And then and then Christmas comes around. It's like more turkey, huh? Okay. Well, don't you guys <laughs> yeah, have like that's... Christmas ham? Ooh, oh yeah, no. I good. look. My family we do like a a, a a pork roast sometimes, Ooh. like for Christmas Eve. Like get some ham in there. Like oh, that's great. Yeah, I just Tur- even take take the turkey out. Turkey. It's like basic. Two, well, no, it's just like it's like two giant. Hey, let's all eat a bunch of fucking food meals. <laughs> yeah, I'm just I'm tired of it. Okay, sorry, that was my okay. That was my type five on turkey. Type five. <laughs> <laughs> Thanksgiving um, in general, kind of overrated. That's fine. That's true. I uh, I actually have a very different like upbringing when it comes to Thanksgiving. Um, because mm-hmm. Christmas is a big thing if you're Filipino. Um, because if you're Filipino, uh. Eight times out of ten, you're Catholic, so you know, baby mm. Jesus, yeehaw. Um, and Thanksgiving was definitely just like another American holiday that we'd come and gather together. Mm. But t- growing up, turkey wasn't really a thing, and I think it's kind of common. Well, it was. It was like you know we understood well, turkey. Was well, I mean a thing. they they invented turkeys. Yeah, in, like, yeah, the no, 90s. I, I was <laughs> the concept of turkey was a thing. It was not a thing for your. Fa- I was being an asshole. I'm sorry. Please don't. Please don't. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Eddie came in first. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, yeah, please tell us how please tell us how you ignored Turkey for ten years. Yeah, we ignored Turkey for like a whole generations. But yeah. um I, I don't know if it's like a, an Asian thing or if it's like an Asian American thing or something. Um because um my SO they they still had turkey a lot. Um that was always part of their like experience, family mm-hmm. experience. My family experience was not turkey. It was Chinese food. It was Chinese takeout. I've heard that a lot, yeah. Which is also still very tasty in lieu mm-hmm. of the turkey. Um, and then eventually we got around to ham, which Ooh. is very, very good. Um, the honey good. roasted ham. Um, and then there's some, like, what is it? Some kind of controversy. Controversy. Uh, like, what do you call ham on the East Coast? Is it like this or is it that name? I forget already. What, um, what other name are there? Yeah, what, what other name is there? Hang on, I'm Googling different names for ham. <laughs> there's a different name for ham. Or what? it's like a... Okay, hang on. Uh, okay, hang on. Hey, this game's okay. stopping. I just typed in different names for space into Google. I don't know. What do you What do you think? Just see if you can name any of the top ten. Different mm. names for something. Any Ooh, any of the top game. ten. Okay. Um, different d- different names for. It's tough. 
I, I can't oh. think of anything. Isn't it based Sex off of your? <laughs> yeah, wouldn't it be based off your like? I don't. I I so hope not. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm gonna run. I'm sorry. I'm gonna. Uh-oh. I'm going to run through this real quick, and then we'll talk about Ham. Different names for Grandma, God, (laughs) Weed, Water, Jesus, Blue, Grandpa, Sugar, Money, and Halloween. I can't think of any searches I've ever done that would lead to any of those. I like how Grandma's really high on that list, and Grandpa's, like, near the bottom. Fuck you, Grandpa. Yeah, Yeah. fuck Grandpa. (laughs) Yeah. Your, your pappy I, or your gramps. Okay. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Okay, different names for ham. Now, do you think I should go to ha- should I go to thesaurus.com and look for hands, ham si- synonyms? Ham si- Sure. Huh. Let me see. It was here. like a brand of ham that oh. is specific like spam? to New Jersey or Pennsylvania. And so in New Jersey, we called it the specific brand, but everyone else called it something. Oh, something. like, so so kind of like the Coke versus like soda. Yeah, versus that makes sense. Sort of but thing. why would, yeah. ha- why would like a, a ham thing. be th- that popular? Like in England, they call them peppers. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Yeah, okay, so I am okay. I'm on the Wikipedia page for lists of hams, mm. which is its own distinct page. Just want to be clear. Um, under United States, I'm getting a uh, chip chopped ham. What? Um, I'm getting city ham. <laughs> I'm getting uh, country ham. What? Glazed ham, and Smithfield ham. Those are uh, those are your options in America. Um. I'm trying to figure out the difference between city and country ham. Hmm. Well, Other I think than... probably, probably city ham. One has city a... ham votes blue. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Co- country ham owns land, and city ham votes blue. What about um, Babe Pig in the big city? Y'all seen that movie? Oh, that's right. That was like. A sequel a long to Babe. Time ago. Is that the one that was done? One of the one of the Babe movies was done by um God, what's his name? Um, Mad Max Fury Road guy. He oh, really? really interesting. Did he do yeah. like Happy Feet too? Let's find out. Yeah, he, he also did, did Happy, do feet. happy Feet. Yeah. Big. Is his okay, name George? Cash that check. George something. Romero? No, George not Miller? George Romero. George Miller. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, George he Miller. did pi- uh, Babe Pig in the in the city. Wow. There you go. Um. <laughs> Hey, okay, this fucking, this United States list of ham page is like, it feels like I'm reading something from another fucking dimension right now. (laughs) City ham is the name for a variety of brine cured hams that are not dry cured or dried, so must be refrigerated for safe storage. It is known simply as ham in regions of the U.S. where country ham is unknown. What? What? A fucking sentence. <laughs> what? Country ham unknown? That is yeah. fucking mysterious. Now, if you don't know what country ham is, you probably will just call it. It's just ham, you know? Yeah. yeah. Um, but if you know what country ham is. We need to, listen, we need to mobilize and cancel <laughs> these hams. <laughs> there needs to be one ham. And I'm leaning, I'm leaning honestly for chip chopped ham because it's fun to say. <laughs> um, what a fucking which is is a is a mixture of ham chunks and trimmings and seasonings ground together, then packaged into loaves. It's a luncheon meat. Um, so not sliced, but chip chopped. No, well, eventually. I'm sorry. This is this is fucking wild. <laughs> the ham cinematic universe. <laughs> I, I the just Lord's like. Beef. <laughs> just the concept that like officially i mean it's on wikipedia so it's law officially there's a difference between city ham and country ham is basically country ham is like uh uh, uh smoked so it's a cured um oh. you don't have to refrigerate it um oh. i'm hungry yeah yeah i am too <laughs> yeah yo guys <laughs> no, i'm hungry we still have 10 minutes I'm left hungry. though I, I hey I could talk about ham for ten more minutes if y'all want, but you probably don't want. I'm What's like, what a else? Ham hawk. I'm like, what else should we talk about? There's there's a Ruby episode uh, coming out this there... Thanksgiving weekend. That's cool. <gasps> yeah. Oh yeah. Um, funny enough, the chat when you guys mentioned that Volume Nine was uh, done writing, everyone's like, "So you guys gonna talk about Volume 9? And I'm just like, "Are we? What are we gonna yeah. say? 
Yeah, yeah what are we going to say about yeah. it? <laughs> Spoilies! Yeah. Volume 8 doesn't even fully out. Like, what? Yeah. True! <laughs> hey, you know what? Let's finally give everybody what they want. Um, let's just let's just start saying what happens in every episode from here to the end of the season. Let's just. <laughs> what start. if we just did that? What if like everyone's like just starts asking spoiler on. questions and we're like, okay, yeah, sure, this yeah. is what happens. <laughs> yeah. yeah, chapter four. Um, yeah, everybody dies. <laughs> Uh, now I'm really excited for chapter four this this weekend on Saturday, Saturday. 10 a.m. If you're a first member, be there. Thank you swear. for being a first member, and you can watch it. If you're not a first member, I guess you have to wait. You, know, you, wait. <laughs> you can watch chapter three. I guess you can watch chapter yeah. three. Chapter three is good. It's though. true. Also good. We appreciate your support regardless. You can. You can. Hey, watch chapter three is great. But ne- on Saturday, <laughs> chapter <laughs> four is better. Chapter four. Okay. I am very excited. Unironically, because last for last Saturday, <laughs> chapter three was better than chapter two. It's just, you know, they keep getting better. getting better. And it's really, it's about the date. I just want to be clear. Um, all I love all chapters equally. Um, I'm getting a call. Carrie doesn't have here. a favorite chapter. Child. No, I don't. My favorite chapter is ham. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I'm hungry. <laughs> I, I just, I'm also mad that after all of that, after two Wikipedia pages, I still don't know what you're talking about, Isa. <laughs> <laughs> Me either. Tyler Tyler just said, like, I'm from the East Coast, and I don't think I've heard of that before. And I'm I think like, Isa okay, just, like, I... made something up. Did yeah. I just, like, what was, what's that Reddit thing that happened, or that phenomenon where it was, like, oh, you like, think of a movie? The, or are you talking about, like, the, the Bearstein Bears, Bears thing? Yeah, yeah, the Bearstein Bears yeah, thing, yeah. yeah. I was just like, oh, did I just, like, think that up? I... The Mandela effect, Sam says. Yeah, mm. the Mandela effect. Can I can I say the most conspiracy theory, th- conspiracy theory thing I've ever spoken out loud ever? Yes. Yeah. I kind of believe that we're, there's like alternate universes with like the Mandela effect and the the Bearstein Bears thing. I kind of like uh... of all of the ones to believe in. I kind of believe in that one a little bit. Maybe it's just like wanting weird things to happen, but like. Uh... I 100% remember Berenstein Bears with the E. I think we all do. <laughs> like That's 100%. what I'm saying. Like, 100%. We can't all be wrong. <laughs> like, I'm... Is that Something why we're in the happens. bad timeline? <laughs> Have y'all ever... Do, you, do y'all know about the Fruit of the Loom one? No. no. What, what's the Fruit of the Loom Think one? of the Fruit of the Loom logo. Like the one yes. you remember from like, you know, five, ten years ago. Yeah. What was in it? Some grapes. There's I remember grapes, grapes. Some grapes. Apple. There's a banana. banana. There's a banana. Right. I remember apple. Do you remember so, anything else? Something mm. green? A, a green apple? I don't the, know. It was the green grapes. The grapes are green. Were they? I thought they were purple. Do you I remember like purple. the the like cornucopia thing? Yes. Like the, the like the the brown actually like, don't. Yeah. Okay. Actually don't. So don't. you see, or Aaron, you might be from the other one. Uh oh. Uh, Stav just posted it in the in the thing. That cornucopia thing never there. It's never been a part of the logo. I don't ever. remember. Ever I don't remember that. Yeah. yeah, I don't. Remember I remember the it. I remember it a hundred percent. Issa and I are from a different timeline. Mm. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That that one. That was one of those ones. That was one of those things I found at at uh, on Reddit at like eleven forty five at night one time, <laughs> and, then you and I was up until like two a.m. <laughs> having a fucking panic attack because oh, I remember no. that cornucopia being there. The cornucopia was there. No, no. I yep. don't remember. That no. wasn't. Says, that's what i'm saying i'm saying they merged they merged y'all are y'all are, oh y'all are infiltrators <laughs> oh my yeah. God. by the way brock from uh chat confirmed this for me it's a uh, taylor ham versus pork roll oh i've never heard either one of those mm, so okay. so t- so taylor ham and pork roll are supposed to both mean ham the same thing yeah it's supposed to be like some kind of like ham thing that is like so weirdly specific. Yeah, I I know I. I understand. We have okay. <laughs> I this is a joke. <laughs> we we obviously have bigger things to solve as a society, but we have to start somewhere. And I think we could maybe start by just saying, let's just call it ham. <laughs> you know, uh, fuck you. <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit! <laughs> Oh no! Oh, we, no! We can't agree on anything as a people. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I'm hungry. Oh my god! Not to, I'm just... not to derail, but semi-related. This is my segue. Talking yeah. about trippy things. Uh, did y'all watch that short indie animated film I linked? 
Oh, Wait, the, no. Um, no, uh, the Kuparia? Kuparia? Yeah, Kuparia. I think that's what Oh, it's shit. Uh, it's I've just, seen it before. I haven't Pep-aria? watched it. Though. It's just a short three-minute indie film by uh, film director Shingo Tamagawa. Sure. <laughs> 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 Eddie, um, I finally understood. Puparia Pig. Yes. Puparia Pig. Yeah. yeah. Um, I, it's a. Uh, I guess he directed one of the Gundam series. I know. I'm sure Stab's like. Oh. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but uh, it's very. Interesting. It's probably Zoids. No, it's not. Um, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it, other than it's really cool and kind of trippy and a little unsettling. Um, oh. Okay. It's just three minutes. I thought it was cool, and we like to talk um, animation here, so. Yeah, and ham. ham. And ham. And ham. I'm gonna watch shit out of this. Usually, I don't watch the trailers until like if I usually I think it's a trailer and I'll watch oh, it. Oh no, this is live. this is the whole film. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna watch it's the shit very, out of this. It reminds me of like, uh, kind of like Ghibli, but like darker and like Mobius. If y'all are familiar with his work, it's very mm, I know like, Moby. surreal. Yeah. Also, uh, um, uh. Uh, sorry, this is entirely unrelated, oh, no. but uh, but I saw this and I couldn't I couldn't not talk about this. Uh, B down in the chat just pointed out that the Fruit of the Loom logo is the ruby colors. Is it? <laughs> There's like white white grapes, like white and yellow, white yellow, red, purple, and then like forest, obviously uh, as the the <laughs> green. <laughs> forest. Um, but the Fruit of Loom logo is kind of uh, kind of. The oh, ruby can colors, we get a, a like a sponsorship from Fruit of Loom or like a do yeah. A- Cross. Either one oh, of them. Cool. Either just, dimension. Yeah. One. It's just all of them in like tidy whiteies. Like, yeah. <laughs> I'm sure that exists as fan art already. So oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, nasties. <laughs> um, well, I think with all of that ham and underwear talk, it might be time to to wrap things up here. Our time our time is fleeting. Oh my god. Mm, okay. I'm so Another... glad we're talk about that. <laughs> Next week we'll talk about fleets. Um, tune in. Uh, Tuna. Isa, is there stuff we should talk about at the end? I can't remember. Yes. So, guys. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, you guys, remember there is some awesome, more awesome videos on this website. RVB Zero every Monday. New episodes are out. Um, 10 a.m. Just go check that out. 10 a.m. Uh, and Central. Ruby as well. Uh, more streams and gameplay coming up after this one is um, the AH Post team. Dust stuff gameplay. Thank you, Carrie. Thank you, Aaron. Thank you, Eddie, for joining us today. It's nice to see your face, Eddie. Yeah, mm-hmm. it's nice to see you guys. I miss all. I'm really all. sad that we're now uh, that we're not going to work on Volume Ten until we can solve our ham dispute. But uh, yeah. we'll get through it, Eddie. Yeah. 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 Civil War. Know. Yeah. Ham yeah. Gate. We're each going to yeah. like write our own like AU Volume Ten. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then all of them. The There's Eddie a... one is going to be made in uh, the universe that Carrie and I are from, and then yeah. the one that Carrie, yeah. and the, yeah. the one that has the um, the for the loom logo. I'm gonna yeah. have a cor- yeah, I'm gonna have a cornucopia grim. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Eddie's that's a good design. idea. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, everybody, for watching. Thank you, and have Bye. a great Thanksgiving. Stay Bye. safe. Bye.